You're exploring whether the universe had a beginning and whether there may be more than one. <laughs> how, how are okay. you coming along with that? <laughs> <laughs> okay, well the work I did with Stephen Hawking was looking at whether the universe had a beginning when we take general relativity as the theory. And if you take general relativity as the theory, with some reasonable assumptions, you deduce the universe had a beginning. But quantum physics takes over and so what we're really saying is that if you go back far enough we have to run into the quantum gravity era where we have many theories about what might have happened but we have no definitive answer. We finished one chapter in the story when we proved that classical physics says the universe had a beginning but then you stand back and say okay but you're not taking quantum theory into account. Taking quantum theory into account the chapter is still open we don't know the answer. When we talk about cosmology what are we what are we actually talking about? We're talking about the structure of things at the very largest scale so the earth is totally insignificant the solar system we're talking a galaxy is very small we're talking about the structure of clusters of galaxies and how they move where the universe started where it's going to so it's the very largest scale and then at the philosophical end it tries to talk about how the universe came into being and how it comes to an end.